Hello everybody, so I'm going to be playing Stardew Valley. It's getting started here. We are going to start a new game of Stardew Valley. New. And I am actually going to tell to skip the intro because I've seen it a million times so I really don't want to deal with it. Um, I kind of want to try... Let's do Forest Farm. Why not? So we're going to have Noche, farm name is Night Farm, favorite thing is winter. I don't know, just is. So we're going to be girl, and I like doing the, like, super deadly hail one. Definitely, my allergies are just like, Mah. and I'm gonna turn the sound down in just a moment because I know it's a bit loud for you guys. Options, sound, turn it down, and turn that down. Hopefully, that will work. Okay, let's open my box. Parsnip seeds. Cool. Here's a little something to get you started, Mayor Lewis. Thank you, Mayor Lewis. Awesome. So I've played this game a lot. Not with this recent update, though. So, um, like, I've never played with this version of the farm. It's going to be clear and sunny all day. And the spirits are displeased today, so don't go fishing. Uh <laughs> Chop wood and search for wild forage, share some cash. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Okay. Wow. That's. They're not joking. Forest right on your doorstep. Okay. So, let's clear some of this out. To make room. For. I need to rearrange this. This will annoy me. Pickaxe, axe, hoe, side that. There we go. Better. Better, better, better. This uh, new update is kind of interesting. Uh, the first one I did was the one where there are monsters. And it was kind of like anticlimactic. But this one is, is vastly different of a farm. This is kind of cool. Oh, God. It warmed up today for the first time, and, like, all of the trees must have just been, like, <gasps> pollen everywhere because I can't breathe. <sighs> like, oh, God, I'm going to die. But, you know, it is what it is. Eh, there you go. All right. How many do I have? I have 15 of these. Five. Five. And... Five. And then I have two of those. One, two. So let's get my paw snips down. I love this game. It's so like relaxing. It's just like, yeah. Let's let's do the farming thing and like I don't know, forage for stuff and hang out. Like cool. And I need to get some wood. Oh. Pfft. Like why won't it cut the tree? Uh, that would be because you're a numpty. <laughs> Oh, a tree to cut it down. It just doesn't work that way. Um, 
I want to get enough wood up to um, make me a, tr a chest so I can put stuff in it. Because until I can get enough gold to successfully um, upgrade my backpack, not having any space is going to annoy me. Like, really badly. Um. Gonna run out of energy rather quickly. But you kinda always do. It's a fact of life that your character in Stardew Valley is a spoonie. <laughs> Come on. But I will do as much as I can before I run out of energy, which is about there. Oh, there are a lot more pawns in this version. That's cool. I wonder if you can catch anything good in them. In, like, the original farm, you can't, like, catch anything in your pawns. down to the bottom. Sadly, the mousey's not going to be in, so no hats for me. But that's okay. I like my hairstyle. So I don't really want to wear a hat that much. I wish I could change my, change my boot color. I don't like these boots. They're ugly. Horseradish! Woot woot! Another one. Up and around and down. Yeah. Oh. Mm. Okay. I'm gonna actually get rid of the sap in favor of a dandelion. Yay. Oh, dang. You know what? We'll get rid of the mixed seeds for now. Because those are a diamond dozen. Foraging is more important at the moment. Hopefully my allergy meds kick in soon. Hi, Haley! Haley's too involved with their camera. I didn't notice you. Fine! I didn't want to talk to you anyway, Haley. Let's pop back up to the farm and build that chest really quick so I can get rid of some of the stuff in my backpack. Alright. So, over and up and over and up. Ah, there's worms. I want to dig them up, but I can't. Okay, so, crafting. Well, this is going to be a problem. Chest. We'll pick that up and we'll drop it. And we'll put... put you up here? I can't! Sweet. Let's throw all this in here for now. And we'll take you back. We'll take you back. Keep the rest of it for when I get the Junimos, because we're going to do the community center version. More dandelions. And more dandelions. Ooh, a daffodil. Yeah. Let's go do the thing. Let's head up here. Anything exciting? No, not really. Nobody's out. You know, it is like 
quarter to four. So I guess that makes sense. Ooh, there's another daffodil. What's up, Robin? <clears throat> Meeting everybody is exhausting. Is your husband not around? No. What a butt. Fine. It's your fault. None of your family is around. Oh, there, there's Demetrius. So, greetings. I'm Demetrius, local scientist and father. I'm studying local plants and animals. Have you met my daughter? I have not met Maru yet, I don't think. Um, nothing really over there. Let's go up and say hi to Linus. Linus is cool. He likes up, yo. A stranger. Hello. Don't mind me, I just live out here alone. Let's give him a daffodil. This is a great gift. Thank you. That's why I like Linus. Doesn't matter what you give him. He's generally like, sweet. <clears throat> he appreciates like anything really. Like he's just like, "Oh, a gift." Doesn't matter if it's, you know, a dandelion or, you know, a gold bar. He's like, "Oh, you thought of me." And that's just cool. over here and give this part out of the way. I really don't like Jojo Mart. But, welcome. I don't believe we've met. There. I did the thing. Now get me out of here. I don't like Jojo Mart. They're jerks. Mean people trying to kill off small communities. Ooh, let's go, go meet Alex. Hey, you're the new girl. I'm Alex. Totally. It's Maru. Maru. I'm Maru. Small town like this can alter that dynamic. Yep. Hi, Penny. Oh, did you want something? <clears throat> no, just to, just to meet you so I can, you know, say that I did kind of thing. I don't know. Seems like a thing to do. Ooh, mm -hmm. shell. Oyster. And surprise, there are no clam shells. Like genuinely surprised. There's usually a ton of them. Around the gravestone. And this way. So let's see. Here. It's Haley and. I can't remember who else lives here off the top of my head. Let's just Haley in. And I met her earlier. Oh, I guess I can talk to her at least. Haley's a bit of a brat. Oh, you're the new farmer girl or whatever, are you? And I'm Haley. If it weren't for those hideous clothes, you might be pretty. Thanks, Haley. You shallow bitch. <laughs> Does that mean? Probably, but come on, dude. Come on. Like, I've been running around a farm all day. You expect me to smell like roses? Alright. Up and over and up. And we're back. Bee -bee -bee. Okay. That. Oh. I can't remember what all I have sold. Or what all I have stored. Okay. I have a dandelion already. I do not have that. I do not have that. <clears throat> we'll get rid of the dandelion. There we go. Alright. Let's get some light up in here. And then go to sleep. Because that makes sense. Sweet. Level 1 foraging. 
You guys can look at that pretty screen for a second while I grab a tissue. Because my allergy meds are finally kicking in. Huzzah! But thanks to the magic of wireless headsets, I can walk and talk at the same time. <gasps> Marvelous! I can multitask-ish. Ish. It's a pretty big-ish. Sometimes I can't do that. Sometimes I can't walk and walk at the same time. And we've made money! Yay! That's a good thing. We need money. One sec, I'm gonna mute it really quick. Okay, sorry about that. Uh, like I said, allergies. It's gonna rain all day tomorrow. Oh, not what I meant to do. And, dang, the spirits are displeased again. Well, I guess I can't fish yet until I see Willy. But my backpack is full. Yes, yes, but I don't have a spare 2,000. And Willy! Willy, Willy, Willy. Happy. You can go get me a fishing rod. After we water our plants, because we're responsible farmers. <laughs> Gotta be all like respectable and shit. Oh. To the beach! I will do that, but. First, a bit of a look see. So, I'm really hoping that this recording works. Um, I use Coral Video Studios and I've been having some problems with it. Where it'll record for like 30 seconds and then stop. I need eel. Oh, I can't, I can't get eel yet. I can tell you that already. <clears throat> Um, so hopefully this works. If it doesn't, well, you won't know that I said this, but if it does, yay, everybody cheer. That's why there haven't been more episodes of Oxygen Not Included, because I did like a whole hour long stream and it didn't record. Yeah. And so I haven't been able to face going back. <laughs> I will though, I promise. Oh, hi there, miss. Heard there's a newcomer town. Good to finally meet ya. I'm still trying to unwind from a month out on the salty seas. It's a big haul. So lots of good fish. Finally saved enough to buy me a new rod. Here, I want you to have my old fishing rod. It's important to me that the art of fishing stays alive. And hey, maybe you'll buy something for the shop once in a while. Aw, thanks, Willie. One sec, guys. Sorry, my husband was asking me a question. No. Uh, sorry about that. My shop's come back open now, so come by if you need supplies. I'll also buy anything you catch. So it smells, it sells. <laughs> That's what my old papa used to say anyway. Yay! I can fish now. Alright, yeah, let's join Willie and fishing off the dock. And then we'll head up to the general store and pick up some more seeds for our garden. But they don't open till 9, so I've got a few. I mean, it would take me that long to get there, but I might as well catch some fish first. Maybe. Possibly. Come on. Here, fishy fishy. Yeah! 
God, this mini game took me ages to be able to do it. Like, it is not the easiest mini game ever. In fact, it's quite a big pain in the butt, to be honest. Let's be honest here, guys. I mean, nobody was good at that game from the get-go. Yay, a book! Yay! So, I may have played the crap out of this game, but I have never gotten all of the library books. There are just so freaking many of them. Up to Pierre's. Oh, that, that's Alex. Sorry, Alex. You can suck it up. Yay! Alright. Let's get potatoes. Um, some tulips. And I think we'll call it there for now. Actually, wait. One bean. Because I know I need a bean for the community center quests. And I don't want to have to wait a whole year. <laughs> All right, let's go. Okay. So, one, two, three. One, two, three. One, Two, three. Potatoes! Yum. And next up. One, two, three. One, two, three. And one, two, three. three. And my flowers. I have this habit in this game of accidentally failing to water one of my, like, stock plants like that one. I don't know why, because I try my best to pay attention to it, but sometimes it's just like, oh, I totally failed to water that, and it died. Great. Great. <clears throat> but, you know, is what it is, right? Helps if you use the axe, not the hoe. Really. Really. I kinda like this farm because, like, I don't ever use the whole thing anyway. Oh. Well, fine. Let's go drop stuff off. Like, my herring, clay, all of this. And we're gonna go like that. Sell my dandelion. Who would wanna buy? It? I mean, I guess you can make dandelion wine and all that stuff. But I, would, I don't know why you would buy it when it's pretty simple to like walk out your door and get dandelions. Maybe somebody who lives in the desert or something. Or a brewer, somebody who has to make a mass quality quantity. You know, something that would take way too many to get yourself. I guess I answered my own question there, didn't I? Yeah, well. It is what it is. <laughs> is there still a greenhouse? There is. Good. That's happy. That's happy, happy. Alright. Back to this. Get as much as we can. And a bunch of them in the water. Yeah, that annoys me every time. Like, I get why it does it, but it's still like, Mer. Why'd you gotta do that? I can't control what way this falls, but I should be able to. Yeah, I know I'm feeling exhausted, but I, I wanted to plant that. 
Okay. Let's go do a walkabout again. This is kind of like my usual thing for this game. Is that like, I'll work on the farm, and then if I end up like exhausted, I'll go and I'll forage. Because for some reason foraging doesn't take energy. Which just doesn't make sense to me. Like, foraging takes energy in the real world. Like, but, you know, this is this is game world and not real world. As evidenced by the fact that, like, the Junimos exist. <laughs> nope. Eh, 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 eh. So, it was my husband's birthday yesterday. So, everybody wish, go wish Illegal Priest a happy birthday, first off. I'll link his channel down below. He plays Call of Duty. Oh. Uh, <laughs> But, uh, and so today, since we both worked yesterday, and he works a swing and I work a night shift, so we only got to see each other for like 20 minutes, which was sad, but so we went to the store today and got him uh, a birthday snack, which was lemon meringue pie, because that's one of his favorites. So we were eating that earlier, and I'm like, oh my gosh, like, I just want to pig out on it, it's, it's like... It's, aww, you're sweet, baby. He told me I can pig out on it if I want, but I do not want to eat the rest of your birthday cake, babe. First off, like, I don't need to, need to eat that many calories. <laughs> Second off, it's your birthday cake. Yes. There was a big update to Stardew Valley, and it gives you different types of farms. And it's kind of cool. So I'm playing a different... Yeah. It changes... Yeah. It changes your home farm. Like, not the actual shape of the, the space it's in, but what's on the farm. So like this one, I'm doing a forest one, and it, it has, like, a bunch of extra ponds on it, and way more forest space, so you can gather things from your farm which is cool um it's yeah it's interesting it's definitely an interesting oop eh, that's great um it's definitely an interesting update but anyway I was eating his lemon meringue pie earlier and um it was very yummy because it was hot today so I was like yeah something light and refreshing and happy and I don't get lemon meringue pie very often. It's not my super favorite, but every so often it's like, dude, tasted really good. But, but yes, yeah, so everybody go over to his channel and wish him a happy birthday. He, he's commenting he hasn't uploaded in forever. You should. Hi, Jody. Hello again, Robin. And hi, Marnie. Yay. And hi, Pierre. Now, technically, I've, I've met Pierre, even though I bought seeds from him. Let's find out. Who do I have left? Um, the old people, some of the kids. Actually, I have quite a few people left, don't I? Well, fine. I will pop over to the saloon in a little bit, but first, let's meet the old people. First, hey George, now buzz off! Yay, Evelyn! I'm pretty sure I met Alex, but we'll say hi again anyway. Otherwise you'll get pale, yeah. About that. <laughs> I have like a purposefully pale character. Never mind. Um, nobody's home. That's Mayor Lewis's house. I don't really need to go in there. I mean, Pam might be in here. Yep. All right. Sup, Pam? Town drunk. Gus. 
Emily. And Mr. I don't want to talk to anybody, Shane over here. There. There's another handful of people I've met. I'm trying not to sniffle in you guys' ear, it's just, you know, allergies. I'm doing my best though. I just really hope this is recording properly. Because I will be a sad panda if it doesn't again. I already recorded this for an hour today. And now I'm starting it over again. So, yeah. Sweet! Almost 300 gold today. Which is just awesome. Okay. Day three of spring. Bam. Ribbit. All right, weather report. It's gonna be clear tomorrow. And spirits are annoyed today. Of course they are. Everything's growing well. This tree is annoying me. here. You know what? Let me check for something really quick. I need stone, wood, and fiber for that. So that, that, and that. Because I like having a campfire outside of my house. There we go. Much better. What am I going to do today? I think I'll go fishing. Even though it's raining and the spirits are somewhat annoyed. Ooh! My first time gathering on my home property! That's so exciting. So yeah. exciting. I guess I could... Here's some of this, huh? Alright, alright, I'll do that. Let's focus on the home farm, right? Get the home farm clean before I go fishing. As much as I don't want to. Maybe I'll fish a bit on my farm. Maybe. There's this like, ooh, it is a different shape. Because that outcropping isn't there in the other version. Interesting. A lot more big stumps and stuff, too. This is cool. This is very cool. And then... Oh, neat. It's like tucked away back over here. Wait for my return on the dawn of your third year. I will, Grandpa G. Now you don't be a jerk and make sure you come on time. That's right. Uh, I think this time around I'm going to try to get married in the game. I don't usually do that. Because I don't want to have to bother with it, to be honest. A lot of effort in this game to like woo somebody. You'd have to, like, dedicate yourself to it. Like, yeah. I'll make that happen. I never really wanted to put that effort out. <laughs> to be completely honest. I'm like, eh. Y'all just aren't that interesting. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. Let's run off. Let's go fish at the river in town. If I remember correctly, there's something you can only catch in that river when it's raining. So, might as well. Even though it takes you a while. This. Totally worth it. Do do do. 
Alright. Here, little fishy, come into my rod. You can do it. Yay! That's not a fish. That's algae. Not what I was looking for. Fish, you fail. Boo, boo. So fun, weird fact about me. I have never been fishing in real life. Been hunting. Never been fishing. Which is an odd thing. Like, everyone, all of my cousins and aunts and uncles and everybody all go fish. I have never actually done it. Don't ask me why, because I'm not sure. I just never have. Just a weird little thing. Oh, I need to say hi to you. You just moved in, right? Cool. Yep. There you go. Go have fun, Sebastian. I really hope my sniffles aren't too loud. <laughs> it's Pam! I'm in her way. So she's gonna stand there and just kind of dot 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 at me. It's kind of funny. Yay! A fish! A fish! And a chest. I wonder what I'm gonna get in the treasure chest. Yeah! Caught the shad and a couple of coal. Wow. Ah, well. You know, I probably shouldn't do this anymore since my chest is full. Or my, ch my backpack is full. Yeah. That. <laughs> uh, anything to gather up here? Not looking like it. Heading back home. Kind of wish you could put this path down. You know, I like the cobblestone path. I'm not gonna lie, but it'd just be kind of nice. That fire, by the way, is magical. Why do you say? Because it never goes out unless you tell it to. I mean, really, what kind of fire does that? Oh, I have another mixed seed. We'll have to plant it. I am there. Let's go back to clearing stuff out of... Actually, let's try fishing in my pond. How many broken seeds do you think I'll catch? <laughs> it's a real promising start there. Fish up a pile of trash. Yeah! And a newspaper! What, what? Do, do, do. Oh, I got a fish. That's exciting. You can actually catch fish in here. Dude. Dude. That's sweet. Yeah. Go me. Go me. Go me, go. And we wait again. Fishing is not the most thrilling activity. But then again, this whole game is just kind of like a relaxation kind of game. You know what I mean? Dang, I'm not going to get the treasure chest, am I? Ah, oh, well. That was a pain. I, I really sincerely hope that treasure chest was worth it. I kind of doubt it, though. Come on. 
Alright, what did I get? A mixed seed. Definitely not worth it. Oh well. Let's plant it like good little farmers. And we'll sell these fish off. You, you, you. You all go away. I don't want to deal with you anymore. Alright. So, I'm not going to cut all the trees down in this area. Um, I am, however, going to clear it out. So that it's easy to walk through. But I am going to cut down things in this kind of land. So that if I want to plant there at some point, I can. You know? It makes sense, doesn't it? Can't wait to have the greenhouse again. The greenhouse is so nice. It is hands down one of the most useful additions to your farm. Like, oh, I can grab grow shit year round. And you want to know what I grow in there year round? I grow an orchard inside of my greenhouse because it is really nice to have the ability to have the fruit every single day all year. Like, it's got one growing season. I don't care. I want a cherry in the middle of winter. I will. Like, dude, yeah. I'm a rock star. Eating pomegranates, cherries, and shit. Whenever I darn well please. Oh, well. Let's get rid of you. See if there's anything good under here. Not really. And we will go back over here. And I think there might be thunder. But I could be mishearing since I have my headset on. Could go either way. I would say both are equally likely. Okay, who else do I have yet to meet? Um, kiddo. I haven't met some of the girls. Leah. I haven't met what's-his-face that lives down by the beach. But I don't care enough. Whoop. Normally I don't go to bed in the game that early, but... Yeah! Level 1 fishing! Look at all this monies. It's gonna take me a while to get enough to get the next backpack. <laughs> I don't see why you can't have a night owl. Expect lots of- yes! Expect lots of pollen. That's today here. Happy spirits! And... Yeah, for onions down south of town, which we should go do. But first, we have to water our garden. And the garden's not going to water itself right now. It will at some point, though. Which will be a happy day. And then instead of buying everything in plots of nine, I'll buy them in plots of eight. And put a sprinkler in them. At least until I can make the, the high-end sprinkler system that's a little bit bigger. To be honest though, that one that just does the spray all the way around it, oh, I'm out of water, is perfectly fine. I don't mind getting things in lots of eight. It means that I don't have to frickin' sit here and water it all day. Details I know. It's onion season! Let's... Oh, so it was thunder I heard? Sweet! 
It's the only part about this time, right, like this kind of weather and this time of year that I really love. It's the thunderstorms, but we don't get good thunderstorms here. I, yeah, we just don't get good thunderstorms here and it makes me really sad. But it is what it is, right? It's the trade-offs you make. I do like living in Portland for the most part. Like, like anywhere, there's it's definite downsides. Um, pretty big upsides, but also, you know, balanced out by some of the downsides. Like, the fact that Portland police are not the best. But, you know... I really like going to school here, and I met my husband here, and I like the goth scene here, and, you know, I can't complain about all those things. Got some really good friends here, but, you know, Portland Police needs to step up, but, whatever. Okay, that looks like all the onions I'm going to get for today. Let's go meet some more people. Is the kiddo in here? Um, she has nowhere I can get access to. No real point in shopping there until I can afford, like, the, co the Cooper the Barn. I don't know which one I'll go with first. Probably the Cooper, since there's a quest for that wander into all these people's houses. It's just such a weird thing. Oh, come out so I can talk to you and get that checked off my list. But no. You've got to be a butt and just like stay in there. Man. Why is nobody just hanging around their house today? What jerks? Don't they know I'm trying to invade their house so I can meet them? <laughs> Yay. I always feel bad for Penny. Like, the town drunk for a mom cannot be easy. Living in the crappy version of an Airstream trailer. But, you know. Yay. It does seem like you don't have. Oh, yeah, I know I don't have anything to donate. That's because I haven't really gone much exploring. Alright, let's meet Clint. What's up, Clint? Town blacksmith. Cool. Thanks, dude. <laughs> you know. What's up? Alright. I think... I just have... a few people left. How have I not met Leah yet? I mean, really. Um. Let's see here. Oh. Wrong one. Looking for a ripe potato. Sorry, Pam, I don't have any. But I guess I'll accept the quest just in case I get one by then. You know. Yay! Sup, Carolyn? Okay, keep going. Carolyn should be coming out. Sup? Hi, Abigail. Yay! Church, the exercise room, and I've said it before, and I'll say it again. It is a little on the odd side to be able to just wander into anybody's home. Let me see how much the saplings are. So I don't want a cherry or an apricot yet. Um, let's go for either a pomegranate or an apple. So I need four or six thousand. 
which is a lot, and then 2,000 for that backpack. Answer, you need to make a lot of money, and you're not. Yay, stop Harvey. Yay, all right. Let's check and see. Oh, that's my delivery. Introductions, 23 out of 27 people. Getting there. Getting there. Um, let's see. We're gonna really try to find some of these people. Um, kiddo, Sebastian. Okay, so these two live outside of town. So let's go down to the beach and see if we can meet. Um, what's his face? Down here. See if he's home. It's locked. Okay, Elliot is not home. Just creepy. He should be home so that I can meet him. An anchor. That's a thing to donate. Let's go do that. That way, I don't have to carry it around. That's right. Pragmatic as always. I have no use for an anchor. So, the museum can have it. If I had a use for it, I would use it for my use first, and then the museum can have it. Dun dun dun. Abysmal. Not a single piece in the entire collection. <gasps> hey! What's this? You found something. Let me see. Ooh. Hmm. Interesting. Remarkable, it's very old. I'd love to study this in greater detail, but it's yours. Hmm, I've got a favor to ask you. Would you consider donating any new artifacts or minerals you find? Who knows? I might give something to you. Think about it. Alright, I will. And... Oh, that is actually quite the thunder. Alright, there we go. Archaeology. Money! Um, so, ooh, I need to meet you. What's up, Sam? Nice to meet you. Alright, there's another one done. Let's see. Pardon me, Stiffles, again. It will get better. Have I met you yet? Yes. I have. And I've met Emily. Um, nobody in here. That is quite some thunder, babe. Exciting. Ooh. Dang it, Leah. Get out here so I can meet you. You know? Rude, I say. Rude! Choose to be around when it's convenient for me. Yeah. Grr. Look at me being all egotistical and stuff. You need to be here at my pleasure. So I can get this stupid introductions quest done, because it's really, really the worst one. I can't stand it. Like, really? I have to go find every single one of these people and introduce myself. I can't not do it, because, like, that would just be annoying. Woo! Okay, I think I'm just going to finish today off in-game and call it there, even though this is a little shorter. I kind of want to go outside and watch the thunderstorm, to be completely honest. Um, so, I'm going to finish this 
stay up. Come on. Whoosh. All right. What can I do around the farm? I have energy, so I might as well clear some more of this stuff out. Let's do that. I mean, it is 6 p.m., and it won't take that long for me to deplete my energy since I'm cutting down trees and such. Wow, I have no room in my backpack, so I should go dump this off. And I did water my plants today. Okay. Let's sell my onions, my daffodil, my clam. Because money, money is a good thing. Why is there a fish in here? Bam. Sell you too. I don't need no stinking fish. Right now, especially not if you're not gold quality. Whoa! <laughs> Can hear the neighbors at the bar going, "Woo!" <laughs> That's funny. Yeah, I'm gonna go outside. So, cut down another tree, maybe two, since that should just poof my energy right up. One. And this one's gonna annoy me because three fourths of it's gonna fall in the water. It's like really. Oh, maybe not. It went that way. Sweet. All right. So guys, I am gonna call that good for today. Sorry, this is a little short. It's thunderstorming, and we don't get those often enough, as I said. And my allergies are still trying to be a butt. So I will catch you guys later. I promise I will put more Stardew Valley out. Because I love this game. And if I'm going to play it, I might as well record it for you. You know, pragmatic. And yeah, day five of spring, starting next time. Have a great day, y'all.